We are back with you on World Championship Wrestling. Jim Cornette, manager of the Midnight Express. Wait a minute, I know what you're thinking. You don't know yes, what I'm thinking because you can't think yourself. I know what I'm thinking and I'll tell you what I'm thinking. I should be in a good mood today. I should be a happy man today because first of all, I told all you people I was going to be 1985 Pro Wrestling Illustrated Manager of the Year and it came to pass. I told you people we were going to hurt the Rock and Roll Express real, real bad and the prophecy came true. The Rock and Roll Express are on the run from us. They're scared to death. The very mention of the name Midnight Express sends chills and shivers down their back. So I should be a happy man, Tony, yeah. but I'm not. Do you you're, know why? No, you're not. I'll tell you why. You're concerned, because of right? No, I'm not concerned. I'm not worried about those two goofballs. I'll tell you what I'm upset about, because all across the country, ever since what we did to Ricky Morton, shut up, you idiots. Ever since what we did to Ricky Morton, I have had five, maybe six thousand letters from all a bunch of teeny boppers all across America, little 12 year old girls saying, oh, why'd you do that to Ricky? Why'd you do that to Ricky? With their little crayon. Well, let me tell you something, you little prepubescent little females. You are just the same as your parents. You're just the same as your older brothers and sisters. You can't spell for one thing. You don't know any words over two syllables. And furthermore, I'm not interested in your putrid little comments. I don't care what these people think. I don't care what you think. I do what I want to do, and the Midnight Express gets what they want to get. And if you want to write me your stinking little slimy letters, then you better tell us how great we are or don't say anything at all. The letters come in by the thousands to World Championship Wrestling here. It takes me time to read them. It takes my secretary's time to read them. It takes my assistant's time. And I don't care, like I said, about your putrid comments. So quit writing me. And Rock and Roll Express, get ready to lose those belts to the next champions. The greatest combination ever in professional wrestling. Loverboy Dennis and beautiful Bobby, the Midnight Express.